doesn't get old. Anamorphic lens, as you can see, is shaped really weird. Variable diopter, four by three aspect ratio. Bend the light onto a camera. An optical scientist allows you to focus this lens without having to focus the lens that's behind it. I collect a lot of random things that I get obsessed with over the years, mostly photo related. You see the world the, the same way every day through your own eyes. It's really interesting to, pun intended, look through a different lens and, and kind of gain a different perspective. These lenses, just they kind of evoke an intangible vibe, which is actually pretty beautiful if you stop and take a look at it. I am Driven's uh, photo post-production artist. Every photo in this office goes through me at some point or another, whether it's for retouching, compositing, even file management stuff and organization. On set, photos are taken, and then when those photos are done being captured, they go to me, and then I do all of the retouching and the compositing. There's gonna be dust, there's gonna be scratches, there's gonna be imperfections in the packaging, there's gonna be imperfections on the table. So it's my job to make stuff look perfect for when we deliver to our clients. The best thing about working at Driven is everyone's super collaborative. Anytime I have a question about something, I can go to a project manager, I can go to one of our creative directors, I can go to a designer or a video editor, and we can just talk about how to work through certain problems. And everyone kind of has their own perspective here and expertise, and so it's kind of like creates this very useful hive mind that comes together and creates this amazing stuff every day. So um, we also have a really dope coffee machine. I've been photoshopping since I was a kid. I enjoy it and I can sit down and do it indefinitely. I found the perfect thing for me to do professionally because it's adjacent to the things that I love. So yeah, I'm pushing pixels every day, baby. <laughs> Game over.